Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the cheapest versus the most expensive sports car in the entire of GTA 5. Yes, guys, we're back. This series isn't done yet. And what I have to do today is first off, turn off the effect. <laughs> Was the intro cool enough? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> but today is going to be an amazing day. We got Michael and Trevor behind me having a barbecue. You know, it's sunny outside. We're allowed to get together. And uh, what are you guys doing already? Oh, some burgers. One for me, one for Michael, one for Trevor. And there's one spare on a plate. You guys know what that means. It means it's for you, but only one of you guys can get it. So drop a like on the episode now if you want to get the burger. <laughs> Have you done it? Have you done it? Who got the burger? Let me know in the comments. The burger's gone. Who got the burger? Let me know in the comments. One of you guys did. <laughs> anyway, the rules are very simple. Michael, Trevor, and Franklin each have their name inside this beautiful mug over here. How's it going, Mr. Mug? <laughs> and I drew out the names one by one. The first name chosen is going to review the worst of the worst, the lowest of the ends of sports cars in this game. And this isn't any old sports car. This is the history of sports cars. Not just stuff you can buy in the game, stuff you can add in from other people as well. <laughs> the second person is going to be able to review something decent. You know, it's not too bad. It's pretty good. <laughs> and the third person chosen is going to review you, the creme de la creme, the best of the best, the one which is going to make you so jealous. You're probably going to watch this video with a very, very angry face. <laughs> Here we go, guys. The first person chosen is going to get the worst vehicle in the game. Who is it going to be? Who is it going to be? Who is it going to be? Franklin, Trevor, or Michael? Franklin! Hey, unlucky, buddy. All right, I know you're hosting this, but it doesn't mean you get the best one. Who is going to be next? Michael or Trevor. Michael! Which means, Trevor, you get the best sports car in the history of GTA 5. You're gonna love this. Okay, I'll turn off the effects now. I'm sorry if that was, uh... <laughs> I'm sorry if that was different. Let's get into the vehicles. Well, there it is. The cheapest of the cheapest. I promise you this is a sports car. It, it just might be 100 years old. <laughs> I present the AMC AMX SS. If I got that correct. Probably not. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? What? Are you no, you're not crushing this vehicle. Franklin, get in it before they crush it, buddy. There's a skeleton inside it. Wow, this vehicle is so old. There's an actual skeleton with a Santa hat inside it, dude. Okay, well, we're just gonna get inside this thing, and, uh, is it really from 1937? I doubt it is, guys. I, I doubt- no. No, it can't be. <laughs> Hello, buddy. How are you doing? The AMC AMX SS 1969? I, I didn't quite get that, guys. Was I, was I right? I, I don't know. It came up in the corner. <laughs> hey, buddy, what are you up to? All right, I'm moving. I'm moving. I don't want them to crush this car. Well, I've already flipped it on its side. Franklin, you have done a terrific job of this vehicle. Is it this vehicle or is it our fault? I'm going to say a bit of both. <laughs> so, what's your name? Not much of a speaker, huh? Don't worry. Me neither. Well, he clearly likes Christmas. It's good to see they care about the interior. There's dice on the front and uh, the engine looks like it's shaking back and forth as if the vehicle is about to explode. There's also a clock here, which isn't working. Uh, very nice. Very retro display. And I quite like this steering wheel. You know, it's, it's made out of scraps and stuff. And what? Ni nitrous. There's actual nitrous in this? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Dude, from a first glance, I thought this thing was a goner, but it seems like it's still running. And it's got the American flag on the back, guys, because America. Straight off the bat, this thing has pretty... Oh, my days. Straight off the bat, the suspension on this this seems okay. <laughs> <laughs> Not the best, but it seems to like bouncing around everywhere. So we're just going to try and work with that. Acceleration, though, still not too bad. It must be that nitro. Oh, my days. This thing is going to fly away if I'm not careful. <laughs> Check this out, guys. Whoa. Oh, my goodness. How is this vehicle so unstable? Well, now I know why it's the worst sports car. <laughs> <laughs> it can't even drive in a straight line. We're going to do some tests, guys. Let's put this on the highway and see if we can actually drive this home in a straight line. Because right now, this is shaking all over the place. <laughs> it's awful. Franklin, if we make it out alive, <laughs> then I'm going to call that a success. We're going way too fast for this beast. Way too fast. I can barely even steer this. Oh, gosh. Well... This definitely deserves the spot as the cheapest sports car, guys. It really does. <laughs> you must be the craziest person in the world to want to buy this. Whoa! <laughs> and we flipped it again for the millionth time. At least the windows are intact, though. That's probably the most expensive part about this car. We haven't smashed a single window. Hang on, I want to try something. Let's see if we can do a wheelie in this beast. <laughs> Accelerate! Here we go! Oh, that's what we're talking about! That was insane! All right, and brake... 
And let's do that one more time. Let's do it one more time, guys. Just keep reversing. Keep on reversing. Come on. Reverse. 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 And three, two, one. Put on the acceleration. Oh, yes. That's what we're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> I love this car. You know, for a couple of dollars, is it even worth a couple of dollars or is it free? I have no idea, guys. Either way, it is a beast. And let's slam on the brakes. Here we go. <laughs> oh, yes. We didn't flip. How we didn't flip, I have no idea. This car is so much fun. Hey, Michael, how are you getting on with your car? Let's go check it out. Hey, Trevor, you still want one of those burgers? Uh, no one's eating them, guys. What's wrong with my cooking? Michael, it's okay, all right? Trevor clearly has an acquired taste. Actually, we know he has an acquired taste. Have you seen any of the missions with him? <laughs> Don't worry about it, Michael. Let's go and check out your car. Well, apparently it's around here somewhere. Michael, you're gonna love this car. Okay, I present to you one of Elon Musk's finest creations, aside from the rockets and, you know, those things which land as well when they come back down from space. Apart from those things, <laughs> the Tesla Roadster, which is uh, just beautiful. It's just beautiful, guys. This is the Tesla Roadster worth uh, quite a bit of money, uh, but it's still the middle grade car. And uh, you can see it's got the Tesla logo. It is one of the finest sports cars out there. Tesla on the number plate and stuff. This is only a prototype though. Believe it or not, this is a 2020 release and it's a prototype. The interior isn't actually that good, but for the vehicle itself, it it's the Tesla Roadster, guys. If you've seen any information about them, you will know they're good. <laughs> oh, they got the map in, which is pretty nice. We can see Los Santos, but I want to test out the auto drive. You know, the thing which Tesla is famous for. So, Michael, <laughs> first up, let's just give this a go. So, oh my days. Acceleration is pretty powerful. Very powerful, actually. You can tell this is electric, guys. Yep, it's an electric car. <laughs> In case you guys didn't know. Whoa. Oh my days. We haven't crashed this yet, though. Yeah, okay. I've seen enough. Now it's time to test out the auto drive. We're on top of a multi-story car park, so it might get confused. <laughs> I'm going to set my location somewhere nice. Actually, let's go back home. I'm going to set it over there. Hey, Amanda. We're coming back to, uh, for lunch, actually. Perfect timing. Why not come back for lunch? I fancy uh, an egg sandwich. That wouldn't be too bad, actually. Egg mayonnaise. Smack some cress and pepper in there. <laughs> you got yourself a good lunch. Okay, Tesla Roadster, take me to my egg sandwich. All right, we've gone. No, no, not off the ramp. <laughs> what? <laughs> what kind of auto drive was that? Dude, I... Oh my days. Well, at least we got off the car park, guys. I, I gotta say, this auto drive thing definitely needs some working on. <laughs> and we're going so fast. What? Oh my days. Okay, do you mind? Do you mind not doing this? We are literally speeding through Los Santos. I want to get there in one piece, please. <laughs> oh, oh gosh. Okay, braking is pretty good. Braking ain't bad, guys. Nice. <laughs> we're actually scaring people on the road. We're going that fast. Uh, my house isn't up here. <laughs> it's not up here, dude. Watch out. Oh. Oh my days, have you seen that? <laughs> we were so close. A person, a person. Okay, we'll just write that one off, guys. We'll blame it on the Tesla. <laughs> Break again. This thing is crazy. Oh my days. All right, and there's my house. Nice. And uh, just take another corner. Watch out. Yep, that's fine. It wasn't my sign anyway. And we have arrived. Hey, Amanda, I'm back. <laughs> Jump out, Michael, quick. Oh my days. That was one incredible journey. I don't think I'm going to get back in that again, guys. That is a very fast car. Anyway, I'm going to go and get my egg and crest sandwich. You guys have now seen the, uh, <laughs> the Tesla Roadster 2020. Now it's time to go over to Trevor and find out what his vehicle is all about, guys. The best of the best. And trust me, if you even think about affording this, think again. It is worth that much money. <laughs> Let's go check it out. The Bugatti Cento Diesi. Please tell me I said that right. I really hope so. <laughs> I behold the Bugatti Cento DSZ. I don't quite know what it means. I'm guessing Ciento means like 100. So maybe it's like the 100th anniversary. I don't know, guys. I have no idea. But this beast is worth so much money. Even if you were Bill Gates, you could only buy a handful of them, guys. Th th that much. <laughs> okay, maybe not that much money, but there's still a lot of money, guys. I mean, look at this thing. All right, it's red and it's black. But the moment you go backwards, you begin to reveal the true beauty. You know, it's it's got the gold tint, guys. I don't know where it is, but it's in there somewhere. There's gold in that vehicle somewhere. <laughs> and even the number plate says sports car. It is the king of sports cars. And if anyone tries to take this title, you're wrong. If you've seen any Bugatti cars, you know this one's a sports car. Just take a look at it, guys. I mean, one first glance, and you can tell, you know, with those five holes on, on the windows and stuff, that makes it a sports car. <laughs> the lights at the front, that makes it a sports car. The wheels, they're sports. The aerodynamics, it's sports. Even the number plate says sports, guys. This is 
one amazing sports car and it's even got the spoiler just to tell you that guess what guys it's a sports car <laughs> this isn't any of those supercars we're not dealing with those today we're going into sports anyway i know you guys are thinking let's take a look inside so trevor are you clean all right you, you've dusted off we cannot afford to put even a scratch in this not even a grain of dirt <laughs> the billing on this vehicle is way too much so much i may never be able to film another video again not even joking <laughs> it's pretty serious guys <laughs> actually i think i know a way to clean out the car if you subscribe to the channel right now then maybe the owners might forgive me if we do do anything to it i mean what's there to lose apart from free content every day <laughs> doesn't sound too bad to me oh look at that design guys it glows it actually glows at me dashboard everything you know it looks quite normal actually to be honest loads of buttons and wheels and stuff not quite sure what they do <laughs> we'll get there though we'll get there and for some reason my door isn't actually attached properly should i be worried nah we'll be fine luckily we're playing as trevor all right let's test out the acceleration oh my days look at the engine hang on guys i'm opening up the doors <laughs> oh man really we can't open up the back i was really hoping we could oh my days all right let's let's lock them all again there we go oh now we're talking guys acceleration is pretty smooth not powerful smooth you know you got control over this if you're in a sports race i have a feeling this thing might not win in a drag race, but it will definitely win on the track. Look at it, guys. We're picking up speed at a very, very strong rate. Handling isn't too bad. That drift around the corner, pretty beautiful. <laughs> and it's just a straight stretch all the way down here, guys. And we're going to do another amazing drift at the end. You just wait. Oh, 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 my days. And wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Do another little drift. No, no we're not going fast enough. <laughs> around the corner and into Los Santos. We haven't scratched it yet, guys. Not too bad at all. <laughs> it's the first time we've driven a car for 30 seconds and we haven't damaged it <laughs> oh, oh no okay i take that back you had to do it didn't you trevor you just had to do it regardless speed on this can climb to quite a high speed i'm gonna give it a go right now guys we're gonna focus and we're just gonna drive we're not gonna crash we're not gonna take any sharp corners we're just gonna drive in one straight line <laughs> you can tell it's a heavy car because it is not picking up speed quick enough guys it's a slow process i i can forgive it for that guys you know it's not the best of the best but now we're talking we got some speed <laughs> <laughs> no one will be able to catch up to us. Oh, hang on. The brakes are pretty bad. Look what we did. We just completely did it in. Hang on, guys. This is strange. The front is still okay. Maybe this car is made out of the most expensive materials. Maybe that's why it's worth so much money. <laughs> I'm actually finding it difficult to damage this car. This is the vehicle I always needed. We should have got this one from the start. Out the way, guys. Out. Oh, no, you don't care. Okay, it doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> Keep on driving, Trevor. We gotta pick up that speed. I gotta say, I actually feel like I'm in control of this. Apart from the bad brakes and the fact I have crashed this a few times, I still feel like I'm in control of the car, believe it or not, guys. Do you believe me? No. No, don't worry. I don't believe myself either. <laughs> but driving it down the straight, I gotta say, it's uh, it's holding on pretty well. A little drift around that corner. Quite wide, though. Uh, to be honest, with me behind the wheel, I think we'd lose every single race we were in, guys. <laughs> yep, most definitely. Which is why I've taken the liberty of taking this beauty to the airport. And then we can finally figure out exactly what features this vehicle has. Because I'm convinced there's more to it. <laughs> apart from, you know, apart from the indestructible frame materials and this slow acceleration, but very powerful speed. There's got to be something else to this, guys. I can just sense it. I mean, look at all the buttons on the inside. They gotta do something. <laughs> Let's give them a go, guys. I did it. I did. I did some tweaking, and I found out we were actually in normal mode. You're know, driving mode, civilized mode, <laughs> and then there's sports mode, and then there's sports mode boost, which is so much fun to play with. The braking on this is insane. Like it's actually incredible, and the acceleration on this is uh, equally as incredible. Come on, under the plane, under the plane. <laughs> That's what we're talking about, guys. But check this out, okay? Three, two, one. Break, Trevor! Oh, dude, the G-force on that would have been crazy. <laughs> and let's get some speed up here, guys. The acceleration is out of this world, though. Now I know why this car is worth so much money. As a sports car, no one can contend with this. But check this out, guys. We're not done yet. <laughs> I call this one the neck breaker because, yeah, it literally breaks your neck, guys. Ugh. Are you okay in there, Trevor? Well, I don't think we're going to be driving that car anytime soon. But luckily, you guys subscribed, right? I hope you did. Or else the owner's not going to be very happy. He didn't want me to damage his car at all. He may never let me film another video again. Quick, if you have not yet subscribed, press the subscribe button, guys. It's free, and there's still time to do so. Anyway, thanks for watching. My name is Nord. Smash that thumbs up button if you enjoyed the episode. But from me and Trevor and the rest of the crew, have a great day, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much to these amazing people for becoming a member of the channel. If you guys would like to have your name randomly, 
randomly selected and featured at the end of every video just like these amazing people, then press the join button just below this video and become a member of the channel today. And feel free to watch another video. There's two on the screen right now. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys soon.